Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to actually change the directory in your terminal. So to change the directory, first of all, you need a directory. And I'm actually going to reduce the size of this. Actually, I don't need to. So you just type in CD, the path to the directory, and that's it. I, you can, it's really cool. You can just drag that on. That gets the full path, and it will change to it so there we go so for us type in pwd the new working directory is this another cool thing you can do is if let's say there's in here there's a bunch of other folders we want to change to bin instead of dragging this over we can just do cd bin and if you don't specify the full path with a backslash at the start what it will basically do is look is there a folder in the current folder that i'm working in name this if so try and switch to that if not like if i just put gobbledygook you'll say no such file or directory so now how about uh, i'm actually gonna switch back to this i'm gonna clear this for now so what else can we do here so if we want to change to a okay no that's fine we don't need to do anything else oh do, 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 do. What else could we do? So if we want to switch back to the previous directory, we do cd dash, and this will literally switch back to the directory that we were you know, previously working in. So imagine if that directory, imagine if you've got loads of files downloading, downloaded, sorry, you set some stuff up, you're setting some more applications up, you're switching between folders, you can't remember what that last folder was that you was in, you do that, this will just switch between the folders so you can also essentially go up a directory so if you are in here bin maybe you want to go back to the flutter directory you put cd dot 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 you'll literally go back type in cd dot 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 again um i will keep going back i can't go back any further than this so this is the furthest i can go back now if i type in ls as you can see we are basically in the root directory and we are getting files that we generally shouldn't be messing with so let me switch back to the flutter directory so yeah really that's all you need to know in terms of changing directories you can you know sort of combine this and do some really cool stuff so by typing clear imagine if you want to switch back to directory so to document you do cd dot 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 forward slash dot 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 and forward slash again this will jump one so it'll be in development then you jump twice another time then it'll be in documents as you can see we are in the documents now and yeah that is literally all there is to changing the working directory in terminal or you know in your bash whatever you're using simple as that if you have any questions feel free to pop me a message and as usual I look forward to seeing you in the next video.